Hello there, how are you doing? Welcome back to Gamer Central. So, guys, in today's video, we are going to discuss why Adopt Me just got into huge trouble in 2021. Are you guys excited? So let's get started. So, keep up with me till the end, comment right below this video, subscribe if you still have it, and turn on post notifications for more videos. Number 5. Robux Scam The person trying to scam you will say that if you give them a specific object, they'll pay you in Robux. Seems pretty straightforward forward, right? The weird part is when they say they'll pay extraordinary amounts for items they can buy multiple of in that same price. This is the first strike. To protect yourself, check their avatar. It may just show the starting items, which will make you believe they have no idea about how pricing works and you may be able to trust them. However, most people saying things like this are scamming you and there are various ways in which they can even customize their avatar to seem trustworthy. Number 4. Thank you for not scamming me. Scam. Another scam requiring a group effort. Again, someone will say they're selling an item and anyone interested can talk to them about it. What'll follow is a message from their accomplice, who will pretend like they're having successful transactions with this scammer, so other people trust them. They'll thank the scammer for not scamming them, and it will lead people to believe that these two players have had an honest interaction. That would be wrong. Once people have been fooled, the classic scam will begin. They'll tell you to send the money before they give you the object, and as soon as you do, them and their friend will vanish off the face of the server. Number 3. Your child stealing from you People are geniuses when it comes to cheating other people. If you are ever role-playing in Adopt Me with a stranger, they may try a few things to scam you. In the beginning, it could be going fine. They will be interacting like your baby. It's all good. Suddenly, though, they'll claim it's their birthday on one random day and will wait until you give them a present. The baby will not leave it alone and won't let you complete your daily tasks or anything and will start screaming in your face. This gets super annoying. Finally, you may give in and find an item you own that you'd like to give to them. Depending on how long they've been your child, you may feel pressure to give them a good pet. Once they receive it, they will leave and your pet will leave with them or if you give them a common animal, they will act like a brat for ages. Number 2. Trust Trading in trust trading, you have to believe that the person you're trading with will not accept the trade before inputting whatever they have to give you. You may think that this is dumb because no one would go through with a trade which is so risky. Unfortunately, people like the risk factor and they find it thrilling to do this, of course, until they get cheated. If you do want to try your hand at this, I'd recommend going through with it with someone you know, maybe even in real life. What's going to happen is you'll put in your side of the trade, which could be an item or Robux, and you will hope they'll uphold their side of the bargain. Then, before you can rethink how dumb this idea was, they'll accept the trade and disappear. There you go, you're out of your object. Number 1. The Auction Scammer A scammer may hold an auction in hopes of stealing some unsuspecting player's beloved pets. They will usually exist in two different forms, from two different accounts, so they can back the main one up when needed. The auction will begin and they'll usually start by saying something along the lines of the winner will get this super rare pet that isn't available anymore so please send me your best pet. Since they've had the second account telling people they aren't faking it, the auction goers may be coerced into doing it and as soon as the scammer receives all the good pets they will leave the game and those people will lose valuable animals. This brings us to the end of our video. I hope you enjoyed it. Hit like if you did and don't forget to subscribe to our channel so that you don't miss any of our videos in the future. Also, watch the two videos that are on your screen because I'm sure you'll love them. With that, I'll see you in the next video.